saxophone channel it's Saturday saxophone tutorials I want to say if you are new to this channel please subscribe to the to this channel click on the subscription button and the bell beside the subscription button so that you get notified once we upload our saxophone uh, tutorial uh, for today we'll be looking at how to play basic and advanced saxophone articulation basic and advanced saxophone articulation now you agree with me that for those who have bad tones, for those sax players that have bad tone, if you play with art articulation, uh, it's difficult to, to tell the instrument you are playing, if it's a trumpet or a saxophone. You know, it's very difficult to tell the kind of instrument you are playing. But when you play with your articulation, your tone is there. Trust me, it's a win-win for you. Now, for articulation, articulation got to do with using and not using the tongue. Yes, using and not using the tongue. We'll get there. When, you, when we get there, you understand better. Okay, let's look at... Um, on the basic side, we have staccato, we have legato, and we also have legato soft tonguing, which is also called legato tonguing. While for the advanced side, we'll be looking at back tonguing today, double tonguing, and triple tonguing. Okay, let's first of all look, look at staccato. Now, for staccato, it's actually separating the note. That's for staccato, and it's like this. Okay, I'll be playing on the key of G, on auto sax G. Okay, let's say on a Dorian scale. Okay, no, no. Let's let's go to Ionian scale. Let's make it more basic. Ionian scale, which is your do re mi fa so la ti do do ti la so fa mi re do. Okay, on G will now be like staccato, separating the notes will be like that's staccato. I click it again. See how it was, you know, separating the notes. That one is staccato. Then for legato, is actually playing without the tongue. Playing without the tongue. Now it's it goes like this. That one is called legato. You know, playing without the tongue. They has playing a phrase, playing a song without a tongue. Now, the next one is called legato soft tonguing. That one is actually uh, different from staccato in the sense that in legato soft tonguing, you play but your tongue is just, you know, hitting the reed slightly. However, using the word, using the syllable, do, do, du, do, do. For staccato, it's two, two, two. You no, know, you play using this label two two, but for legato you use this label do do do. No, your tongue slightly hitting the reed, and it it sounds like this for legato soft tonguing. If you pay attention, one thing you notice why the sound was going, why the note you know, was going, you hear the tongue in between the note. So it simply means the sound is not broken, or like staccato, it's not a broken sound, it's a street sound, but inside the tongue is just being, you know, uh, there, tongue in the notes one after the other. You know, let me take it again. Try and pay, pay attention. The sound will just be going straight, but 
the tongue is there doing its work. <laughs> It is that for staccato. See the big difference there. So now, one thing I will advise for for those of us who play uh, smooth jazz and uh, gospel jazz, those of us who play in our churches, please try and inculcate legato soft tonguing in your playing. Because you see some sax players, every note from the beginning to the end, you see them playing staccato. No, 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 no. You don't play the saxophone like that. Staccato is very important, but try and play more of legato soft tonguing when you play in church, when you play in your gigs, and when you play uh, in your programs, playing your ministrations. Okay, now let's look at the next type of articulation, which is simply. Uh, more of advanced articulation like I said back tonguing for back tonguing you tongue every other note on saxophone every other note no the first note without tongue the second note you tongue the third note without tonguing the fourth note you tongue just like that every other note now it goes like this <laughs> See how it goes now it's for back tonguing it's very good for for freezing it's very good for freezing now when you play back tonguing fast you you feel the effect of it something like yeah that's back tonguing please don't do with that back tonguing very very important as a sax player Okay, the other one will now be the next one is double tonguing. Double tonguing. For double tonguing, what you do actually is that the first note you tongue, while the second note you don't tongue. The second note you produce it with your, your throat, the back of your throat. The first note is ta, while the second note is ka. So if you put them together, it will now be ta ka, ta ka, ta ka, ta ka, ta ka. It's funny though. Yeah, right? Okay. It's taka taka. So when you speed it up, you have something like taka 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 taka. So if you are playing, let's say a G note on the saxophone, and you want to double tongue, what you now do is that you put the sax your mouth, the first note tongue, second note your throat. Ka. So let's let's say. You see how it is. Yeah, that's a trick. I know some persons when they hear something like that, they want to double tongue with their uh, tongue. Ta ta. You can't get the double tongue in feel when you use your tongue. Ta ta. Like. I'm kind of straining my, my, my tongue and it's making me to want to overbite, which is not supposed to be so. You know, to make it easier, that's why it's called advanced actually. You tongue with your tongue, the first one, the second one, your throat. Ka, ta, ka. Let's take it again. <laughs> Yeah, got the trick, right? Okay, that's a uh, double tonguing, and the next one is triple tonguing. Uh, I think double tongue and triple tongue is a bit similar in the sense that you just add for triple tongue you just add a ta to it. You know, double tongue was taka, so triple tongue will not be taka ta. So to triple tongue you do 
takata 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 one two three takata 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 okay let's say let's say it's on on the saxophone Surprise? Yeah, that's it. Triple tongue. Whoops! All right. So that's just that's just all for uh, advanced tongue for today. So you can see that it's it's quite uh, in between simple and the beat extra work yes okay that brings us to the end of today's class uh i'll meet you in the next class which is on saturday coming saturday we'll have to you know do another tutorial here okay i want to say subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss out on our videos if you are new to this channel subscribe click on the subscription uh, button below and click on the bell beside the subscription button just subscribe and click, click on the bell beside the subscription button so that once we drop the video drop any video you don't miss out from our saxophone uh, class and I want to say we also have a whatsapp group in the description link below you can join the whatsapp group you know it's uh, one group that you don't want to miss out just join and uh, we also do some one-on-one -on -one discussion on our WhatsApp group. Please, you have to be part of that group.